This is the hardware that's causing a stir. The printer transforms a three-dimensional design created on a computer into a physical object. Dr. Michaela Janse van Furen is among those leading the charge for 3D printing in South Africa. Well, 3D printing is when you make a file digitally. You make an object that you want to make on the computer and then you literally email or send that object, that file, to a 3D printer. And the printer then prints it literally small layer by layer by layer until you have a physical object that you can hold in your hand. It used to be on the computer and it's now real. The art world has been quick to pick up on this technology, but 3D printing has applications beyond the creative space. It's being used in medical technology and has unlimited potential. Um, as a technology, you know, it certainly goes far beyond art and, uh, uh, you know, it empowers not only artists but entrepreneurs, inventors, designers uh, to work within a network, um, you know, without a physical address, basically. We're empowered with this global network now um, and it's an exciting technology. 3D printing makes it easy to create once-off items. This is in contrast to traditional manufacturing methods, where large volumes are required to financially justify a change in design. Think of, especially for us here in, um, in Africa, it removes barriers to manufacturing. So all you need is a computer and you need some software, which you often can get for free, and then you can manufacture. You send it to a company that prints it. You only need to get one print to see if you like what you've got. Whereas in traditional manufacturing, you would have had to make a design, get an injection molding, get it, have a huge uh, investment cost before you can see your design and say get somebody to sponsor it or invest into the piece. While 3D printing is changing the dynamics of how things are done, South Africans are playing a leading role in pioneering applications from the creation of a prosthetic robotic hand to the building of the Walt Foster's printer. This exhibition at the University of Johannesburg runs until the 22nd of July.